What is happening? I thought it was time that I check in with you real quick. Uh, I'm about to head out and run some errands, but it's been a few days, so I wanted to catch up on what's going on. I clean in the last video. I pointed out that there was trash down here where Savannah had gotten into the trash. You know, no big deal. It happens. Well, I'm cleaning up the trash. I don't know how the light is here. I'm I'm cleaning up the trash, and there's the like little bug larva in there. So that's kind of gross, but you know, it happens, whatever. Clean it up, clean it up real good. Pick up, spray, wipe down, no big deal. And it occurred to me, maybe I should check my pantry. So I check my pantry and I've got little, not, not as bad, not near as bad, but I got little bug like eggs here and there. So I'm thinking, man, this ain't like Arizona at all. Arizona's not like that. So I clean, I pull everything out of the pantry, wipe it all down, wipe the inside of it down with white vinegar and put a, you know, just deal with it. There's a potato in there, by the way. There's a little potato about the size of a golf ball. And I think that could have been one of the major culprits. I clean it all up. Something I haven't talked about is for about three weeks now, I haven't really had any energy. No matter what I'm doing, I haven't really had any energy and I can't put my finger on what it is. So it occurs to me, I'm going to change my diet and I've been drinking this red box wine. There's, I haven't even gone to a liquor store around here. I quit drinking at the beginning of January because I thought it would make me more productive. Six months in, I thought, man, I'm just wrapped too tight. Nothing wrong with a couple of drinks. I've drank, you know, since I was a kid. So I decided I'm going to go back to drinking. I start drinking this box wine and I'm thinking, man, maybe it's something in that box wine. So I kind of pull way back on that. Still don't have any energy. It occurred to me, maybe my water jug and this jug right here i don't really clean them i just keep refilling this over and over again but i do clean savannah's water dish which is interesting i'll clean her dish but i won't clean my own water jug and i'm thinking with all the stuff in the environment here maybe there's like some mold or something getting in this water so i'm gonna go out today i'm gonna do some kind of a cleanse i got a really nice blender I'm going to get some uh, some fruits and some kale and some different things that I wouldn't probably eat, but I can drink just about anything, no matter what it tastes like. So I'm going to go do that and uh, basically just restock my refrigerator I'm think and freezer. I'm thinking about getting a microwave and getting those uh, little like Amy's meals or whatever, whatever the like modern version of, of Hunger Man dinners is, uh, you know, whatever that is and see if that makes a difference. Uh, let's see what else is going on. Let's take a look at the bike. I got my work pants on today because I'm gonna try to, if I have time, take a look at that uh, generator. The, th the funny thing about working on things is I could fix that generator in 15, 20, 30 minutes, or it could take all day. So I don't know how much of a time suck that could be, but the bike, speaking of time sucks, is all done. I got spark plugs i went ahead and put in some kind of iterum material i'd never heard of before but they're supposed to be a hundred thousand mile plugs put those in i put a new air filter in just because i had it apart put a new oil filter on can't really see it from this side put a new oil filter on change the oil this these things take uh three quarts of oil by the way in case you have a bike like this because i overfilled it and had to go look it up and they go yeah a quart of oil stays in it all the time and button the whole thing up this uh, bike has something called a uh, thunder max mapping system on it and so in the next couple of days when i get some more important things done i'm going to plug a usb into a laptop and it's just like a whole computerized system where you can go in and do diagnostics and stuff and make sure it's cool but the bike's back up and running now i've got the ability to go get gas pretty stoked about that now i got my generators back when i need them i had the solar's been doing a good job with the ac so i haven't needed them but it's always nice to have options what else i spent the weekend with this gal named jen that i've been seeing and that was pretty fun I'll see if I can find a picture and throw it up uh, on the on here for Jen. So that was a good, relaxing situation for me, and we had a really good time. So that was pretty cool. Other than that, I'm gonna go. Sounds like it might be a chainsaw in the background. Some kind of engine. Other than that, I'm gonna go do my shopping, 
try to get my body right. I'm gonna get some uh, bleach and clean those water jugs out and then get on that generator. Oh, and I'm gonna clear, I'm gonna see if I can get this off the ledger, this uh, Battleborn stuff, you know, install those better uh, fuse uh, block holders and a couple of other little tweaks that I gotta do. See, look, I'm pulling in 13.1 right now. That's pretty good. But yeah, so it, everything's on the mend is what I'm trying to say. Everything's on the mend. Hope everything's going good with you too. And I'll see you soon with some review videos probably. See ya.